Thanks for thanks for letting it keep popping up. Thank you. Yes, no spoilers, no spoilers. Okay, so um, I guess we just go right into it. There's a lot of people here. I mean, you guys just got here. I just got here. I haven't looked at any new shit, but I am I am ready to do this. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Okay, I'm ready. I'm ready. Before we get into this, the the list and the skill balance. Wait, no, that that is the one. Never mind. Before we get into the skill balance, I want to check the cards first, as per usual. So, okay, are you guys ready? Here we go. In three, two, one. Oh wait, what? Hold up. Odd Eyes Raging Dragon to a limit one. Oh. Whoa. That is so interesting. I, and, and I do see Blue Sky down there as well. That is so interesting. That means they can't play Volo now with their... Um, they can't play Volo anymore, right? Kill pens. I hope they touch the skill in some way. No spoilers. Ugh. Excuse me. <laughs> um, I hope they touch the skill in some way, but this essentially kills Volo from the deck, so you can't run Volo anymore. So now your turn one board is just going to be Abyss Dweller or Roach, and then maybe some back row. Maybe you start running more back row. I don't know. For Odd Eyes, Raging Kex. Very interesting, very interesting. I like it, I like it. Excuse you, farts? I didn't fart, that was a burp. Jesus Christ. Alright. <laughs> Alright, so very cool. Nice little small hit starting off. Very interesting. Uh, Alright, limit two, we have Mech Knight Blue Sky. Okay. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna spoil myself by reading the text. Due to being able to use this card with the other limit three cards such as Mech Knight, this card is now limited two. Oh, so they kind of... We gotta get it. Nice. All right, so basically they buffed. I would say they maybe buffed Blue Sky, right? Because now you can use it with purple. I think. I mean, I don't know what else they did, but let's let's keep going down the list. I guess now you can play two Blue Skies and three purple, maybe. Ooh, Speedroy Fuki Madoshi Piper. To a two? Wait! It's to a two! That means it correlates with yo-yo. Okay, okay. All right, Konami. So now you can only play one yo-yo. Now you can only play one yo-yo, huh? Wow. That, um, that lowers the consistency quite a bit, yeah, I would say. For sure. For sure. Now instead of just having Yo-Yo in your hands, you would have to search Speedroid Terror Top and then search either your Takatomborg or Yo-Yo. So the chances of actually having an opening play now is much, much lower. Wow. That's a very strong hit. Imagine not wanting to zoom zoom. I know, right? <laughs> Imagine. Wow, Fuki Madoshi Piper to two to correlate with the Yo-Yo. That's pretty, that's pretty base. Not gonna lie, the Meg Knight Blue Sky to two is kind of, it's kind of a buff for Meg Knights. That's interesting hit. All right, let's keep going. Farfa to two. Oh, that's good. Oh my God, they just didn't they have this guy to limit one before from the last ban list. Now he's at a limit two. Oh wow! So the, now you can run. Now um, Beatrice is at a limit three, and Tour Guide is at a limit three, right? Um, the other guy is off. What was his name, Sir? Sir is off the ban list, and now Farfa to two, so you can run two Farfas. That's really good. I like that. I like that. Yo. Some people in Discord are going to be happy. They're going to be happy about this. We got a lot of uh, base BA players. Okay, very nice. 
Very nice. Let's keep going. Oh! <laughs> Orcus! <laughs> ah. Okay. Wait, 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 Unless they hit another card. No spoilers. Unless they hit another card. This means nothing right now. Because currently, orc, orc cunts play two nightmares anyway. So, let's see. Make the indie going... Okay, forget about it. Um, Mech Knights are not coming back. I'm sorry. Mech Knights coming back? What? Who said that? <laughs> Mech Knights? Hello? Okay, so now you have um, now you have three purples. You have one blue and one indigo. All right, cool. Very nice. Uh, I'm glad they're not coming back. Fuck Mech Knights, bro. Bro, I don't want to go through that meta anymore with that freaking skill drain. Hello? <laughs> they switch. Yeah, they literally, literally backstab each other. Okay, all right. Okay, I want to see Konami. I want to see another limit two for Orcus, or else this is kind of pointless. Orchestrated nightmare to two copies. That's really nothing. Please show me something else right now. Oh my God. <laughs> I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. All right. People just said keep going. That's all I saw. That's all I saw. Just keep going. All right. All right. I read two. All right. Limit three. We're done with the limit twos. That's it. Pretty honestly, pretty solid hit. We'll review after we're done. I want to keep going. <laughs> oh my God. What am I going to see? What am I going to see down here? What's it going to be, dude? Come on. Hard four. Pot of greed. Come on. You, you can do it, Konami. You can do it. It's an SR? Okay, okay. Oh! <laughs> Alright, your boy made... Check, go check my ban list prediction video, please. Go check my video right now. Alright? I would say link in the description, but... Honestly, I just released it. Just go watch it. Just go watch it, bro. Alright? Harp! This freaking whore! This whore. <sighs> okay. Scrap Keck is at a three. This bitch is at a three. I want I want more. I want more. I want more. I want more. Uh Dark Contract with the Gates. A limit three. Okay. To due to the limit lift for Z Savon Kepler. Okay, I just spoiled myself. Savon Kepler is apparently off the ban list. Okay. Okay. All right. Um. Cool. Savon Kepler off the ban list. Dark contract with the gate back to a limit three. Wasn't this card a limit three before? Didn't it used to be a limit three before? Did it just take it back after being... Okay, sure. Transmodify is to a, to a limit three now. Okay. Transmodify was to a limit one. And they basically said, we're killing Infernities. By the way, we're killing Infernities. Oh, by the way, we're killing Infernities. With that weird limit one transmodify hit. Back to a limit three. Okay, sure. I guess. All right, sure. There you go. There you go, and for any players, rejoice. Wow, this look, dude, look how long this list is. Look at it. I'm not even like halfway through the, the freaking thing. Konami, what did you do, bro? What did you do? Ritual Beast Tamer Elder. Okay, so, um, Sean Matry, you know, shout out. There you go. I don't know about Ritual Beast, but I assume this is pretty decent for them. All right, cool. I have no... Oh, that's it! We're done! 
Wow, okay, so they kept Scrap Recycler to a 3 and a Harpoor. <sighs> I mean... Why are they so against hitting the fucking Potter Greed card? I don't understand. That Potter Greed card is everything. They could just run three Potter Greeds, three Harpoor, Skeleton, two Nightmare Orchest, Galtail Dingirsu not touched, the the Wand. Like, like, I... <laughs> What like again? What 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 did they do? What did they do? It, X rays, it, X rays. It doesn't matter if they're U R. Al Alistair the Invoker was also a U R, and they and they limited Alistair back then. I know they didn't hit the pot for Mech. Wait, for Mech? I mean, yeah, but Mech Knights were not as abusive. And abrasive and disgusting as Orcus are. Mech Knights have not done what Orcus have done. Okay. They've, they've gotten close, but they haven't done that. Harpoor, again, like this is not going to do much for the archetype. You're just not going to run scrap anymore. But you can still run three Potter Greeds and Harp. The limit 3 means no compulse, no IDP, sure, whatever. But like, they don't even run that. They'll just run their babble. I don't know, man. Again, fucking, it's always a roller coaster with Konami's ban list. Alright, no longer on the list. Let's see. Magician Navigation, no longer on the list. Okay, okay, alright. Okay. Okay, so Dark Magicians can now freely play this alongside Magician's Rod. Which is very nice. Um, nice, I guess, yeah. I, I'm, I'm kind of happy about this too, because I think I my, my super old Dark Magician deck had had this as well. And it, it wasn't good back then, so I don't think it's going to be good now. But still, that's that's nice, I guess. Spiritual Beast, Tamer, Winda. Okay, so they're giving us the Ritual Beast and Spiritual Beast. They want they want everybody to be Sean Matry on ladder. Got it. Cool. Uh, I have <laughs> I have no feelings against this deck, so I don't know what to say. But hey, good for you guys. Good for you guys. Alright, moving on. Full Metal Foes Fusion. Uh, I don't even know what this card was limited to before. What was this, a limit one? I guess. Now it's off the ban list, alright. Cool. Oh! Okay, so they completely freed... Well, I don't know if it completely... But Dark Magician is now very uh, open now. No rod, no navigation on the list. Now you can run IDP, Crackdown Compulse. <laughs> um, but you still wouldn't in the Dark Magician deck. But I guess you can now. They want they want people to pl go back to the old Dark Magician deck. That's what they want. They said, we know we fucked up with Magician's Magic. We understand that it's just a plus 17 from the deck. We get it. Can you please go back to the old one? That's, that's basically what they're saying. So, cool. The, the Savant Kepler that we got spoiled from up above here. Um, Alright, Savant Kepler is now off the list. Cool. Uh, will Triple Ds be good again? I mean, they're pretty good as is, right? They're just... 
this will definitely make them more consistent now, for sure. But there you go. Cool, I guess. Tuning. Off the ban list. Oh. Okay. Uh, currently, I think tuning was sharing uh, a limit three with Jet Synchron. So now you can more easily make Quasar. But I mean, making Quasar wasn't that difficult before, so I don't understand why. I mean, plus we have Overtake, right? So like, I don't know, People were people really playing tuning anyway? Weren't they just playing over Overtake? <sighs> Alright, well, there you go. Dark Arm Dragon is no longer on the ban list. I'm sorry, the limited 3 list. They used to be limit 3. So they realized that Dark Arm Dragon with the new chass skill is so garbage. It's such ass. And cannot compete in the slightest. That they're trying to give... Uh, arm dragon players back row now you may have back row that's basically what they're saying cool yeah that is back that is uh back with the milk very nice yeah it's true yeah it's not worth limiting like it's dark is you know dark arm dragon is a great card with the skill it makes it a little strong but now i i think it can compete now if you have back row so yeah which is like <laughs> basically every single deck on ladder right now that can compete with back row Moray of Greed? Okay, no, I don't know, no. No, 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 no. Shark is good, bro. Shark is fine. Like, shark is, bro, shark is already consistent as it is. Like, what, what's the point? Of hitting this card so hard in the past and slowly stop like unhitting it like no this is this is no bro no not more ray of greed come on no shark players don't need any more consistency dude like they're pretty damn consistent I do have to say before I keep going with this list they're allowing more decks to be played which I'm always up against uh, which, I mean I'm always for uh, except to you, fuck you. Um, besides that, they're allowing more decks to actually see play. Also, fuck you as well. Um, which is cool. That's always cool. I always like seeing that. Um, but like, no. No. And no. Alright, whatever. What else? No! 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 Super Poly Alliance is coming back, guys. Woo! Also talked about this in my in my ban list prediction video. Super Poly Alliance, boys. Woo! Would you like to activate a skill that your opponent can now respond to? Would you like to play Super Poly, which your opponent can now respond to? Well, there you go. Now you can do it freely with three copies. Suck on those apples, nerds. Gosh, this is such a long list. Okay, okay. They realized that the Katakuri Merchant, a limit two, literally did nothing. And they said, yeah, we were pretty stupid. We're going to completely unlimit it. So there you go. There you go. Now you can play your Katakuris again. Which, honestly, this this card is great. It's very strong. Um, and hopefully we'll see more diversity in the meta because, god damn it, am I tired of seeing Orcus. <laughs> I'm going to keep going back to Orcus. They realized how shit their ban list was, that everybody and their mom in the WCS was playing Orcus, Speedroid, and all of the above. So, fine. That's cool. No! Never mind what I said about um, Raging Keck not being able to go Volo and Dweller because Raging Odd Eyes was lit to, uh, hit to a limit one. 
Never mind that. You can still do your Volo and Dweller combo. I swear, I swear to God, raging, fucking check skill. The skill better be hit. If not, I'm, I'm, I'm not, I'm not gonna be. No, no, I'm not gonna be playing. I'm not gonna be playing any ranked, bro. Aloof Lupine. Sure, I guess. Uh, Thunder Dragon Metaphys players. Yay. Cool. Awesome. And that's it. Jesus H. Christ. By the way, fuck you. Um, also, fuck you. Um, like... L limit one to limit one. Why? Why? So they can't play Babel with this? Is it was this the whole premise? No Babel. I assume that was the whole premise. All right. Skills. I swear, to God, dude, I'm about to I'm about to like flip a lid if. These skills are not rebalanced, as they say they are. Salamandra Phoenix, Icy Clear Wing Acceleration already. And Relinquished Puppet. That's it. Just three skills. Raging Kex. Have not been hit. Okay. All right. Cool, Konami, cool, cool. Let's read. Salamandra and Phoenix. Hold on, before, before. During this duel, you can normal summon or set Phoenix gear free without attributing. Awesome, very fair. Um, can you use once per duel by revealing a Phoenix from your hand? You set a Salamandra from outside your deck and a legendary form outside your deck. Very fair, awesome. I love outside your deck skills so much. Okay, 10, at least 10 fire uh, warriors. Cool. What did they do? You can normal summon or set... Phoenix Gearfreed and uh, Phoenix Gearfreed, the other one, with one less tribute. Okay. I okay. I already like this. The following effect can be used once per duel by revealing a more exam from your hand. Seven, seven, da, 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 da. Okay. Nice. Wow. They finally did something. Now you can't just play a fucking level ten monster for free from your hands. I know he's not level ten. I'm being um, over exaggerating, but you know what I mean. Very cool. Now you have to tribute summon, just like regular Yu-Gi-Oh. Who would have thought that you have to tribute summon to play cards? Especially high-level cards. Okay, cool. Very nice hit. Very nice. All right, Relinquish Puppet. Let's see. Before you send a level 8 gimmick puppet in your hand or deck to the grave, you play the Death Choi from outside the deck. Uh, blah, blah, blah. At least one monster. No monster other than gimmick puppets. Okay. So now you send a level 8 gimmick puppet... Uh, in your hand or deck to the grave, do you play a Death Choi from outside the deck? Skill can only be... Um, wait, 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 hold on. No, I, I'm not seeing it yet. Contains no monsters other than Gimmick Puppet or Dark Xyz. Contains at least one monster. And no other monsters other than Gimmick Puppet or Dark Number monsters. Okay, okay. So, before it was Gimmick Puppet monsters in the extra deck and Dark Numbers. Now they made a Gimmick Puppet or Dark Xyz monsters. So they made it easier. They made it more flexible, basically. Which is cool, I guess. It's a nice little buff. To relinquish puppet, nothing crazy, you know. Very nice, very nice. I guess I'm 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 all for like buffing irrelevant skills to make them a little bit more relevant. I'm all for that. Uh, this was a very solid hit. I'm happy with this. Okay, here we go. The big one. Clear wing acceleration. Let's see what they did. We already know what happens before, but let's read it anyway. 
So, I mean, we know we know what happens. All right. <laughs> Here we go. Each of the following effects can be used once per duel. Can I normal summon or special summon monsters, except synchro or wind dragon. Okay. If you control a clear wing synchro dragon, play a speedroid red eye dice from your deck or graveyard to your field. That hasn't changed. Return one card from your hand to the deck and send one speedroid red eye dice or synchro monster to your graveyard from your deck or field. If you send a synchro monster, you can play one clear wing synchro from your graveyard to your field. That monster gains attack, blah, blah, blah. Ooh! So no more free foolish burials! I mean, you can still send the speedroid red-eyed dice, but it's heavily restricted. You can't send any speedroid tuner anymore. You first have to return a card from your hand to the deck, so you're already going neutral, well, minus one first, and then you send the die. Yeah, yeah, speedroids have died tonight. Speedroids have officially died tonight. It's over for speedroids. Wow, they must have dominated WCS pretty damn hard. I mean, I feel like... Like, do you think Konami understands at this point how strong a Foolish Burial skill is that your opponent cannot respond to? Do they, do they understand now? Or do they not understand? And will we see more of this shit in the future? Maybe. Probably. Yes, Raging, Raging Boner is still kicking, yeah. No, they, they died, Diogo. They died. They died. And, and I'll tell you exactly why, if you missed the uh, beginning portion of this. Um, yeah. You can do a free Foolish Burial, and... The fact that they hit Fuki Madoshi Piper to two, now you can play. You can only play one double yo-yo and one Fuki Madoshi Piper. Plus the skill nerf. Yeah, I'd I'd say they're pretty. They're pretty dead. I'd say they're pretty damn dead. Yeah. No more, no more Lance and Book of Moon in the back row anymore. That's it. You're gonna go super minus one now if you want to play that dice from out from your deck to the grave, and that's that's given the fact that you open up Wind, the Wind Channeler, search your Terror Top, and then you're still stuck with just Yo Yo, and then you have to send another card in order to send die. Yeah, it's it's a lot. It's a lot. Um, Speedroids are essentially dead. I would say. I mean, like, you can still play Taki Tomborg at three copies, so you still have some plays, but the whole consistency of setting up turn one, no matter what your hand looks like, Crystal Wing, Clear Wing, two back row is not going to be a thing anymore. They might still do Crystal Wing and one back row, possibly, you know, but it's a lot less common now. It will be a lot less common. So yeah, there we go. That was the uh, that was the ban list. Um, pretty exciting. Uh, I'm not sure how I feel about this hard pour at three, while well, nothing else has been hit. I'm not too sure, but um, there you go. Now you understand, and now you have seen it. So, if you guys want to wave hi to YouTube? You may do so. Um, <laughs> but yeah, that's gonna be it. So. Sally KB signing out. Till next time. Peace.